Hi guys, Alex here from Drayton's, here we've got a Vauxhall Astra, 1 litre turbo EcoFlex SRI, finished in Summit White Brilliant Paint. All of the wheels and tyres are in good condition, these are 17 inch 5 twin spoke SRI alloys, nice sporty design. At the back you do get a decent boot and the back seats will fall down in a 60-40 split to give you some extra room in there if you do need that as well. This car has got MLT until October 2024 and was last serviced in October 2023 at the same time as the MLT was done. have uh, cloth sport seats um, so they're not the standard seats you would get in a normal Astra um, but they are still cloth but they are comfortable big balls on the side of the base to keep you in place and you've got the same in the back as well I believe they're called formula cloth um, the style of seat uh, up front we have your rev counter on the left speedo on the right and your digital screen in the center currently showing a digital speedo uh, but you've also got your trip computers uh, timer stuff like that on there and then you've got your vehicle info on here, uh, such as your uh, oil life, uh, tire pressures, that sort of stuff on there. And then your eco index and your consumers on that third tab. Uh, to change the tabs, you just press the menu button on the indicator stalk, and then you've got a little rocker switch to scroll up and down on there. On the main screen, we have your audio. So you've got Bluetooth connectivity for phone and music. You've also got DAB, FM, AM radio. Then on the phone section, you've got your contacts, your call history, that sort of stuff on here. Uh, you do also have projection, which is Apple CarPlay and Android Auto, which you can see just on here. So you just activate those uh, using those, but they should automatically launch um, when you plug in your USB. Um, and other than that, really, it's a fairly simple system. Uh, you do also have front and rear parking sensors, which I'll just pop up on here. Um, so you've got the visual feed in front of you on the driver's display and you've also got an audio feed which you may have been able to hear um, just beeping away there. Um, then there's the shortcut so you've got your home button, track skip, volume and your hands free controls on there as well. Uh, below that you've got your climate control, so you've got aircon, your directional controls, heated rear screen and your temperature and fan speed there. Uh, then we have your engine start stop, you've also got sport mode which will sharpen up the throttle response uh, a little bit as well. Uh, your lane departure, stability control and the buttons to turn the parking sensors on and off there too. Uh, we have a 5 speed manual gearbox which is nice and easy to use, uh, it goes through the gear as well. Um, the clutch is nice and light so if you're crawling in traffic uh, it doesn't take too much sort of effort really, uh, which is always nice, especially if you're in London where you're in traffic a lot of the time. Uh, then we have a 12 volt socket, a couple of cup holders, a proper manual handbrake rather than an electric one, which I personally prefer. Uh, then in here you've got some storage and uh, USB input as well, which is just there, which you won't be able to see because it's a bit dark. Uh, the door bins are a decent size, so you can fit a good size water bottle in there. Um, and then you've got some more space in the glove box with the owner's manual too. So up front we've got a sporty steering wheel, um, nice design, on the left hand side you've got your cruise control, your speed limiter, um, the collision alert distance uh, and the settings for the cruise control as well. And on the right hand side you've got your volume track skip and your hands free controls there. Left hand side as I mentioned you've got the controls for the driver's display as well as the indicator stock. Uh, right hand side you've got rain sensing wipers. Then you have automatic lights and heated and electrically adjustable wing mirrors as well. Just moving to the back of the car. Get a good amount, here's a good size hatchback so you do get a good amount of space in the back. Uh, so the driver's seat is pushed slightly back from my uh, main driving position but there's still loads of room there. Um, and then you have ice fix anchor points on the outer seats and as I said the back seats will fold down to give you some extra space if you do need it. Um, it's a nice little car to drive, uh, the 1 litre turbo engine is nice and peppy, uh, it's got a good amount of perk when you need it and the manual gearbox is nice and easy to use as well. It will come with 6 months gold cover warranty which can be extended for as little as £199 for an extra 6 months. We also have a range of finance options available so if finance is something that you're looking for then we can help you out with that as well. 
If you need any more information on this car or any of the other cars we have in stock, please go to drayton's.co.uk. Thank you.